Hello everyone, welcome to this video. In this video, I'll be showing you how to do the inference using our trained model. So we have already trained our model uh, around 100 epochs, uh, but I will recommend just whenever you are training your model, at least go with uh, around uh, 3000 epochs, okay? That will give you better results. So uh, for uh, inference, okay, there is another file called detect.py, you will see here, detect.py. Uh, so you don't have to change anything in this file, okay? So everything is fine. Uh, you need to give some parameter like your model path and your uh, inference image path okay so uh, see i am uh, doing uh, hyphen hyphen words and i am giving my base.pt okay base.pt path so this is the base.pt just copy make sure the uh, <coughs> train model path okay you are giving here okay so base.pt i am giving here and the source images okay i i want to give a source images so for that what i will do i will just quickly take a source image So there is some of my images, okay, uh, just for testing. So I will just uh, drag and drop here inside this yellow v7 uh, like folder. So you see it is uploading, okay. So once it is done, this hello.jpg just copy the link, copy the link, okay, copy path and paste it here, okay, paste it here. I will just paste it quickly, okay. Now if you run it, so it will take your train model and it will take this uh, test images, okay, and it will do the prediction. Okay, so that should be experiment, uh, it's not experiment 2, because if you see here in the runs, uh, not detect, uh, train, experiment, okay, and uh, here actually I had weights, okay, so that was experiment, okay, so if you are running this uh, uh, trended by second time, it will create another folder called experiment 2, okay, so that's why actually uh, previously I was trying, so yeah, you can talk about, now if I run it, So it will load this model and it will do the prediction on this data. So you see, uh, model uh, prediction has been done and it has saved my uh, this prediction inside this. Uh, there is another folder it will create. If I show you detect, if I do refresh here detect, inside detect it has created uh, two folder because uh, I had run this one for first time so it has created experiment uh, 0 and whenever I run it for second time it has created experiment 2 okay so I will just quickly go to experiment 2 because if you see all the results has been saved in the experiment 2 so this is the hello.jpg it has done the prediction okay so now if I if you want to visualize so this is the code for that but make sure you are giving experiment 2 here uh, yeah experiment 2 is fine now if I run it So guys see this is the uh, like prediction it is giving okay now uh, it is predicting it is hello uh, but if you see this confidence score is like very less like 39% uh, uh, like hello uh, level uh, so why because I have trained with 100 number of box okay so if you want uh, if you are increasing the box size okay around 3000 so it will give you good results with the higher probability score okay and there are some other bounding box it is coming okay it will be also resolved okay if you are increasing the size so yes guys this was all about the inferencing okay you can change uh, any images okay you can change any 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 images here you can give any images and if you want to give videos just give a video file here okay so it will uh, uh, do the prediction on top of your video okay so now if you want to create a web application just you, need, you just need to download this model okay inside runs mm, experiment okay train experiment and weights okay this uh, model you need to download okay and you, you can uh, use this detect.py the same detect.py you can use and you can create a web application okay so you will be passing your images it will do the prediction it will give the images okay you just need to render these images on top of the ui okay so if you want to download everything in a zip file this is the code for that okay you can run it so yes guys uh, this was all about i think you uh, now you got the idea like how to um, train your own custom like uh, model okay using this yellow v7 okay uh, and uh, now just try to explore from your site okay there, there is a official uh, github repository and paper everything you have okay just go through like what are the uh, like uh, new features they are giving okay just try to uh, see everything okay from from here uh, then you will get the idea so yes guys uh, this was all about from this video okay and i think you have all have liked it okay so thank you so much guys for watching this video and i will see you next time